Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel The Informant. If you are new to this channel, let me just remind you that we make videos related to online services, education, placement drives and many more. If you have not subscribed to our channel yet, please do hit the red button so that you get latest notifications first on your screen. So as you all know, today's topic is about Karnataka KCET Seat Matrix 2024. So before starting out our today's video, I would just like to inform you so option entry is coming very soon right so many candidates are in a confusion like many candidates don't know how to fill in the option entry properly even though after getting good ranking they go to very bad colleges and i have seen many of them so we'll be helping you in this so this time we have you know decided to start a new service where we'll be helping candidates to fill in option entry at very minimal price so if you are interested we will give the google form description so please fill out the Google form and we'll get in touch to you and I'm, I'll, I'll, and I'm sure that you'll not regret this decision, right? So please fill out the Google form. Please, uh, you can inquire like uh, what services we'll provide and in what all ways we can help you in option entry. And trust me, it will be very useful. So please, you know, fill out the Google form and we'll contact you. So coming back to our today's topic, that is KCT 2024 option, uh, seat matrix. So why is seat matrix important, right? So assume you want to apply to some college like RV or uh, BMS or any other good college, JC. So you, you don't know how much seats are available and you'll be hoping that you'll get that college. Assume there are this year only 10 to 12 seats or 10 to 15 seats. Assume that uh, RV has a capacity of 10 to 15 seats via KCET. Right, and you're uh, in a hope that with 10 15 thousand ranking you can get RV, so that is not possible. So, that is uh, the reason why seat matrix is very important. So, we'll be showing you in this video how to check the seat matrix of your desired college and how, according to the seat matrix, you can you know plan to put that college in your option entry. So, first of all, let's go and see how to how you can check the seat matrix. So, first of all, come into a browser and search for KEA. So if you search for KEA, go to this first website, cetonline.karnataka.gov.in. So if you go to this website, you can see, if you scroll down a bit, you come into the latest announcement sections, right? So if you come into the latest announcement section here, you can see UGCT 2024 engineering draft seat matrix. So please click on to this seat matrix. If you click on to the seat matrix, you can see over here, seat matrix has opened right for the available colleges which are so in our previous video if you can see we had discussed top 10 engineering colleges with highest placement packages so if you have not watched that video as well we'll put down the link in the description where you can check what is the uh, the highest colleges with highest packages right so few of those colleges let us search for example if we search rv you can see rv college of engineering bangalore so let us come into the computer science and engineering this thing number six if you can see over here total intake is 285 right and total kea government seats available see it is not even half only 128 seats are available in rv if you go through kea whereas other seats are reserved for like physically handicapped seven seats are there for special category for hyderabad karnataka hk rural karnataka right total number of seats are these many and you can see over here for Comet K 86 seats are available so a few people will not be knowing what is Comet K you can give Comet K as well other than CET you can get seat through this but you know fees through Comet K is a bit higher but not as high as you from uh, like you get from the management seats right so even this is useful so if you want any video on Comet K, what is that? Please drop down in the comment section. We'll try to video on, make a video on that as well. So you can see over here only 128 seats for CS are available. And if you can see in cyber security, 27 seats. For uh, data science, again 27 seats. So total number of KEA government seats are available only this much. Let us check out any other college uh, like Ramaya. So if you see in MS Ramaya Institute of Technology, you can see over here for AI and data science only 27 seats are available, right? For uh, uh, CS computer science only 89 seats are available. So I hope you get it right. So what is the mode of this video? Only to let you know, like make you aware that only these many seats. So what people will think 198 seats means total all 198 seats are available. No. 
only for ka 89 seats are reserved but other seats are reserved for various other categories so according to this itself you need to you know uh, do in your option entry seeing all the colleges which you need to put right so at last i want to say again uh, if you need any help in the option entry please fill down the uh, google form which is available in the description and if you need any other help related to kcat or any other thing please drop down in the comment will always be at your service so guys thank you for watching our today's video please stay tuned <music>